Okay, let us see how to install Keel Microvision. You can go to Google and type Keel Microvision 5. Go to this first website that is the official site to download the software. You will click on downloads, then go to product download, click on MDK ARM. So that is this version 5.36. You click on it. You have to fill okay, your information. So fill your name. Okay, your name. Please put a valid email ID. Okay, this email ID will be later used to get your license key, evaluation license key. Company can put anything. Okay, or IIT Bombay if you want. Your job title can be student. Country India. Okay, you can put your phone number. And yeah, you can, if you want, you can subscribe to okay, the notification. Uh, submit this. So it will direct you to the download link. So this is the exe file which you are supposed to download. Click on the exe file. Uh, you can save it. To some folder, for example, I will save it to okay, own folder. Okay, so meanwhile, it is downloading. I will download one more supporting file, which will file. Okay, that is the legacy version. So I have already downloaded, so I have cancelled it over there. So the required second thing that is the legacy. Uh, okay support over there so type in search box legacy support uh, you will okay, get this mdk d4 legacy support you have to click on it and again we are supposed to download the arm7 okay, uh, legacy support so the second one Click on it version 5.25 and you can again save it. Okay, so once your download is completed, you can open the folder where your files have been downloaded. So again, you can see there are these two files. The first one is the about okay 900 MB the file okay, which we are going to install first. Uh, that is mdk536.exe so you can right click it and uh, okay, install it so run as administrator and basically you are supposed to accept all the conditions next next and okay, it will get installed so if you have already installed okay, some standard uh, packages it is almost similar so you can click on next you can click on agree next where you want to install the part can be the default no changes okay you can put the okay, information first name and your email id that's it click on next and it will start installing so right now i already have it so i will cancel it okay similarly okay you have to okay after completion of the uh main part you have to also install the mdk 79525 file so right click and run as admin for the lab experience so again similar process click on next accept next next and all okay. so again i have installed so i will not overwrite my license so okay so these two things you are supposed to install so once you have installed okay both the the packages okay, next step is you are going to uh, update the license for that okay you are supposed to open your the keel microvision so go to start and just type the keel microvision and other, otherwise if there is a shortcut to which is on desktop you can okay, use that shortcut from the desktop so basically your software will be open 
like that. So in the software, now we are supposed to say import the license. For that, we have to go to file, license management. Okay, so here uh, I have already licensed it. So let us see how to add the license. Certain things we are supposed to understand. There is this PID or the computer ID, which will be requiring to uh, generate the license. So let us see the licensing process. Yeah, so the CID is important. So to generate the license, let's see how to do that. We have to go to Google and you can type NDK professional evaluation process. So you can search for this. So this is the link to the license user guide NDK professional evaluation tool. Here as we have described uh, step by step how to generate the license. Again, it is not that uh, uh, complex process. Okay, so as I mentioned, we are supposed to open the uh, Keel Microvision, launch the Keel Microvision, go to Files, License Management. Okay. License Management, okay, uh, you will see this evaluation MDK field over here. Okay. So interface is similar. Because I have already evaluated the license, I am not getting that option here. But yeah, for first instance, you will see evaluate MDK professional option over there. Okay, so you are going to click on that option. So if you click on this option, okay, it will ask, uh, it will open that dialog box okay, where it will tell the computer ID and your email on which uh, you, are, you are going to get the uh, license key. Okay, so click on OK and Okay, again, it will open some dialog box like that where we are supposed to enter these details, your computer ID, your name, the email address where you are expecting the uh, your license key, and you have to submit it. So once you submit this, okay, on that particular email, you are going to get a license key. Okay. So this license key, uh, which you get on the email, you are going to as mentioned earlier, you have to paste that license key, new license ID a field over here. So you will simply paste it and basically you have to click on this add LIC or add license. That's it. Okay. And your key microvision will be ready to use. Okay. So that is how you can install the key microvision IDE. So thank you for listening to this video.